Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. My name is Basil Arashdan. I am in grade eight, and I go to Queen Charlotte Intermediate School in Canada's greatest province, Prince Edward Island. <laughs> Today, I would like to talk about John Tuzo Wilson, an internationally respected expert on glaciers, ocean basins, and the structure of Earth's contents. One of his greatest discoveries were plate tectonics. He was the first person to introduce air photos in, geolo in geological mapping, and he was responsible for the first glacial map of, of, for Canada. John inspires me because he was a really successful person that tried his best to inform us about Canada's geology. We Canadians are awesome people who recognize education as key to making Canada the best country it can be. If we start to learn geology of the second largest country in the world, then we would understand a lot of things about Canada before it's too late. At the end, we have to thank John for all his hard work that now helps us understand many things about this land we all love. Good evening. My name is Joshua Conception, and I am a grade seven student at Holy Ghost School in Winnipeg, Manitoba. I would like to give a toast to Alexander Graham Bell, who invented the telephone, photophone, metal detector, etc. More people should know about this person because he's a great Canadian inventor who made fantastic inventions to make the world easier. One of his famous inventions, the telephone, is an amazing invention which helped people communicate from far distances instead of meeting up in person. The telephone made business easier and helped friends and families connect from all around the world. It sparked a great idea of communication and it helped people connect all around the world. Without communication, we may not understand each other, learn, and understand about history. It is, it is crucial for achieving your goals. So please raise your glasses and join us in a toast to Canada's inventors. Mesdames et Messieurs, bonsoir à tous. Mon nom est Rémi Wallet. Je suis un élève de la huitième année de l'école Paris-Galtier-Blanc à Grand Barachois, du Nouveau-Brunswick. Je me porte à tous, à son excellence, la très honorable Julie Payet, gouverneur général du Canada. Plus de gens devraient savoir à propos de cette personne parce que non seulement Elle est une astronaute qui a participé à deux vols spatiaux. Elle est également la première Canadienne à montrer à bord de la station spatiale. Une scientiste, elle a continué à inspirer la jeunesse et à poursuivre leurs rêves. Good evening, everyone. My name is Shu Yu Win, and I am a grade four student at General Gordon Elementary School in Vancouver, British Columbia. I would like to give a toast to Canada's most well-known environmentalist and one of the most vocal environmentalists, David Suzuki. David Suzuki inspires me for a number of reasons, but right now I'm going to tell you the two most important reasons. First, David Suzuki does not let other people affect his points of views. 
Second, related to my heritage project, David Suzuki believes that the world is all interconnected. Thank you for your time. Please raise, a, raise your glass and join us for a toast to Canada's innovators. Cheers. Good evening, everyone. My name is Kiana Lam, and I'm a grade seven student at Westmount Charter School in Calgary, Alberta, the best province in Canada. Ah. <laughs> I'd like to give a toast to Maud Abbott, a trailblazer in the field of medicine. At a time when women were discouraged from being doctors, Maud went on to become an internationally respected pathologist and a world expert on, her, on heart disease. She helped pave the way so that many more women could enter the field of medicine. And for that, I think she deserves recognition. Good evening. My name is Oscar Cormier, and I am a grade seven student at King Edward Public School in Windsor, Ontario, the second best province in Canada, second only to PEI, where I'm originally from. I would like to recognize Clifton Stewart, agent with the British security coordination during World War II, and my great grandfather. At Camp X, outside Oshawa, Ontario, Cliff developed an early proto-computer, the Rock X. This encrypting-decrypting machine was used for cracking codes and encoding Allied messages and was crucial to the Allied war effort. Alan Turing and his work at Bletchley is well known, but the Canadian encryption contribution has slipped into history. So tonight, let us remember it. And let us remember Clifton Stewart, the spy from PEI, my great-grandfather. Raise your glasses and join us in a toast to Canada's innovators.